Okay, so now we're going to get into cylinders. All right, so this is considered the cylinder practice sheet. That's page 24 you're gonna be working on. So we're gonna start with the regular cylinders. Um, if you see that every cylinder that has a star, I want you to do six of each one of those. So if you see a cylinder with a star, I want you to do six cylinders of each. Okay, if you see where it says one, two, three, four, those are just steps. All right, so here we go. So this is the first one. This is considered the regular cylinder. So when you start doing cylinders, you wanna be able to start with the, uh, they either call them ovals or ellipses. You start with two of those, and then later on, you meet them with a square. Okay, that's your square. So you wanna do six of these. Okay, so I'm gonna go right along with you. See, that's two. Try to stay steady with it. Use your elbow. Use your uh, shoulder if you have to, but try to avoid the wrist. Because if you start doing the wrist, it limits your movement when you start doing larger strokes. See? So, that's, yeah, make sure your cylinders have the lines touching the edges, see? Okay, so that's six of the regulars. Then you have the thin ones. See, you wanna be able to start making distinctions. That's one, that's a thin. Man, I need to go closer here. Okay, so then now if it only takes me this much time to do this, it shouldn't take this much time for you to do this at all. You guys should be really done with this at a Okay, so you see how that is? It's six of those. So now I'm just going to just point this out to you. So now you got the plant pot. So plant pot. That one's a little bit tricky. six of those then you have the three-dimensional one okay so that's going to be a large circle a small one see right there Small one, I mean large one, small one. Voila. If you want, so some of them you could just put a little bit of flare on it. <laughs> All right. Anyhow, so you want three, four, five, six of those. Okay, I'm gonna move the camera down just a tad bit here. Just a tad bit. Okay, so now you want the, that famous 
tuna can, right? That's when it's a little thin. Okay. Thin. And so you want it all the way across three, four, five, and six. And last but not least, man, this angle is pretty bad here. I thought the angle was good. Let me see. Alright, I guess we'll deal with it that way. And then the lampshade. Remember, two cylinders. Excuse me, two uh, ellipses and so on. So just three, four, five, six. All right, so this is pretty much your assignment for today. We're going to do six of each. Each one of them has a star on your worksheet. That's the one you do. If you're confused, I don't know what else to tell you, but we're gonna get into the next part on Monday, but this is your practice on how to do your cylinders. So I hope you guys uh, follow the instructions. You don't have to fit all of them on one sheet. You know, I would say the bigger the better, as long as you can fit six across. Cause you want to get them big so you can get, you know, that stroke in with the uh, elbow. All right, so have fun.